Hi. <clears throat> um, my brother recently came back off a uh, holiday and bought me a Whitby knife. Um, very nice. Push the box to one side. It's a Whitby. Uh, it tells you on the box. Let's have a look. LK128. Nice little, um, nice little lock knife. Uh, can be opened one-handed. Whitby on the blade. Nice camouflage type sort of camping pattern. Uh, I notice the handles like got starlet type screws on it, so it can be removed. It has a nice belt clip on the back and it's stainless steel it's quite a nice uh, sharp blade on it I've been um, I've done the old paper slicing test with it etc right what I actually decided was though that I wanted to make myself a bag to keep it in so, revert back to the classic paracord. Uh, using my um, nail loom, I uh, created an, a sort of a patch, which then I went down the edges, put together, did a straw tie, oh, put a skull on it for a slider, that actually pulls tight knife fits in it quite snugly pull the cords tight slide your school down and you have now have a bag which you can hang around your neck and I put a cobra knot on the back of the bag so you can actually hook it round the back Yeah, a bit rough. First attempt at making a, a bag. Well, second attempt actually. Um, but yeah, I like that. I mean, I mean my first attempt was uh, even rougher. Let's make this sh sort of sheath for another knife that I own. Um, this one's, I keep my Damascus. That's a Perkin Damascus in the uh, again sheaf. Uh, uh, the other thing I wanted to uh, discuss, let's move that to one side. Uh, quick mod for the knife. Let's take it back out the bag. Um, Being a fan of paracord, I made a quick uh, sliding cobra onto there, so I can adjust that up and down. Made it quite tight actually, but the tighter the better really. Uh, also very handy as an extra bit of grip when um, using the knife. So now I can hang the knife like it is round the neck when it's out the bag. All folds up, ties it round quite nicely and it all still fits in the bag. Away it goes. There we have it.